Chief Elections Officer Keith Lowenfield was seeking to stop his dismissal and had asked the court for an order which is akin to an injunction to prevent government-nominated election commissioners Says Raj and Bibi Shadik from participating in the discussions on his dismissal. With the motion upon which his application is premised now amended to allow for dismissal according to the terms of his contract of employment, rendering Lowenfield's complaints of a summary dismissal irrelevant, the decision was taken to withdraw. Justice Barlow allowed for the case to be discontinued. Attorney Kim Kai Thomas, who represented GCAM, had argued that Lowenfield's application was premature and with the motion now amended, he had no longer a valid point to argue. In an affidavit of support, GCAM's Chairman Justice Retired Claudette Singh pointed out that Lowenfield's contract of employment provides two bases for termination. First, as noted in Clause 9, that his services may be terminated by way of three months' notice in writing for several reasons. If the reasonable opinion of Guyana Elections Commission, the Chief Elections Officer, or the Commissioner of Registration is guilty of misconduct, has failed to comply with the terms of his contract, or is in breach of any clause or obligation in the contract. The second basis pursuant to Clause 10 is that the contract may be terminated without notice for gross misconduct, provided that he must be given written notice, setting out clearly the reason for the termination of his contract and be given an opportunity to respond. Justice Singh said the Commission instituted the second basis for termination, but later amended the motion to include Clause 9. But Lowenfield, in his application, had asked for a declaration that he is entitled to the protection of the rules of natural justice and the right to a fair hearing and determination for the motion of his dismissal brought by Gunraj and seconded by Shadik. The fact that the Commission amended the motion to include Clause 9 would have changed not only the circumstances but would have also overtaken the basis of the applicant's application that I contend that the application has not suffered, neither will he suffer any breach of natural justice or a fair hearing, Justice Singh told the court. Attorney Kim Kite had asked that the court dismiss the notice of application, filed herein, and refused the reliefs sought therein. Last month, a motion to immediately dismiss the embattled Lowenfield was moved by Gunraj, while Shadik moved another motion to remove his deputy, Ruxan Myers. The third motion was moved by Commissioner Manoj Narayan, seeking the immediate dismissal of District 4 returning officer, Clement Mingo. The trio is accused of electoral fraud committed last year during the March 2020 regional and general elections.